Hello everyone, today we're into some more Lumion Legacy PvP, and today I'm going to be trying to showcase Infernus. So I'm running a Pyro Fire, Fire, Ed, Fire Essence Infernus with Pure Nimble. And I'll tell you why it's Pure Nimble in a second. These are the moves, I got Fire Breath, Shrewd Blast, Peace of Mind, and Phoenix Flame. And I, it's basically a 200, 200, 100 set with the 4 energy, giving me 250 energy. So this is basically to speed tie Whipple Drift and also speed tie all the 89 tiers that just run nimble. So I'm going to bring this. Bring you for the Erupted Dawn. Cinemars is kind of scary, so I'm going to bring these things for it. And I'm going to bring Zulong, I think. Yeah, I'm going to bring Zulong. Because that Erupted Dawn is looking kind of scary. He leads off with the Icy Goal. Okay. That's pretty interesting. I think I can actually go into my Infernix now, honestly. Yeah, I'm going to go into Infernix now. Although, does Icy Goal really want to stay in? We'll see. It does. It goes for the Chili Chomp. I, it literally does nothing to me. Infernix. I will click Tisama. No, I'm going to click Fire Breath, not Peace of Mind. Wow, Icy Ghoul stays into that. Well, I'm sorry to tell you, but you're kind of... You're going to kind of get faint. You're going to faint. So, bye, Icy Ghoul. There you go. There's one kill already for Infernix. So, that's a good start. With Icy Ghoul being out, out of there is very good. Let's see who brings the next Cinemars. Well, as you can see, I don't want to stay into this. I'm going to go into my Himber. That's kind of the only move I have for it, is go to Himber. Here we go. This Himber. He goes from... Boulder Blast and... Boulder Blast? Question mark? Is this guy even TP trained? I have no idea. Why Boulder Blast on a Cinemars? I have no idea. I outspeed the Cinemars, so if he stays in, he's gonna get smacked. He will get smacked if he stays in. He's taking his time, and he stays in. So, I don't think he is one of the best PvP players in the world. Heck, I don't even think he's really PP trained, but okay. It how it's how it goes sometimes. Let's see what he brings next. He's probably gonna bring Zulong. Nope. He brings Tata. Which I did not bring I did not bring Vesperatu for. Oh dear, I did not bring Vesperatu for this. This isn't good. I got bring this broad. I'm gonna go into rest one then. Just play the safe. Because he's the only one that can really tank a hit. Or tank two hit. Well, I would be able to tank a, a hit if he didn't crit me. That's very unfortunate. I actually don't speed this an almost one shot at it. I probably should have just adapted the salted. Tata goes for the toxic tail, by I'll see you later. I'm going to go back into my Infernix. Now I'm going to do Shrewd Blast just to save energy. I'm going to use Shrewd Blast. There goes the Tata. So my Infernix already got two kills. Which is very good for us. He brings Florent. This Infernix is looking very nice if you bring Florence. If you bring Zulong, I might just stay in anyway, even if he does bring Zulong, because who knows, he might not even be TP trained. Actually, he brings the Arepidon. I'm going to set up. I'm going to click a piece of mine, and then I'm going to Phoenix Flame. And I'm going to try to set up and get a Infernix sweep. Fire Breath, see how much that does. That did like nothing. 
I'm gonna Phoenix Flame and heal my health up. I'm gonna heal my health up. There we go, back to full. Goes for another Fire Breath. I don't... Does he have any other moves? Because I only does like 8 damage. I'm going to go for a rest. Eruptodon should have Mud Splatter. Oh, he swaps out. What did he go into? Okay, we know his last two Lumians. But since I keep the mine, I one-shot his Zulong. And he doesn't one-shot me because I still have 163 health. So, this is looking very good, and Fernix might be able to clean up the game. Yep, he's not TP trained. Because if my Infernix can outspeed the Zulong, it it probably isn't even TP trained. So, yeah, I think this is going to be an Infernix sweep. How about plus one? Shrewd Blast should do at least half. And Infernix in its first game looking very, very, very good. And it's a Fire Slam Erupted on. You love to see it. You love to see them. Fire Slam Erupted on. There we go. So this should be game. Oh, I don't think he knows what to do. I think I think this is game. I think Erupted on is his last one, yeah. So there you go. GG's. And that's the game. So Infernix, in his first game, looking very, very effective. Sir DG. Do I... I'm gonna try to... I might join a double... I might join a double snatch if no one else accepts. I'm trying to accept one of these for battle. So yeah, yeah, Infernix is really good. I really do like Infernix. His design is really nice, and I also just really like its pure damage. It's probably one of the best Lumians in terms of pure damage output, which is just very good. I really like that. Okay, there we go. We got it. Doubles. Doubles match. Now if we have ICO 2-0. ICO 20. Except. And now we're into our next battle. And does Infernix look good in this? Not really. It doesn't look good at all, honestly. Yeah, and also. Yeah, there's a Mutagon. That's gonna be tough to beat. I'm gonna bring Vesperatu. I am gonna bring this, though, still. And I'm gonna bring Terra. Yeah, I gotta bring Terra Claw. Because otherwise, it might just be a disaster otherwise. Yeah, I'm kind of worried about the guy on the left. The guy on the left looks kind of scary. The guy on the right is scary as well, but it could be worse. That's exactly what I wanted. Tata and Mutagon is exactly the lead I wanted. And I am going after that Mutagon first. That Mutagon is scary for my teammate. So I'm going to go after the Mutagon. As much as that Tatab is scary, I want to go after the Mutagon, because my teammate is kind of in jeopardy. And that still didn't even one-shot. Oh my... Well, I guess my teammate was in jeopardy the whole time. Well, that's unfortunate. Goes for Telekinetic. No days. Okay, he didn't daisy. It only did, like, 28 damage. I might just go for the Tatab this turn. Yep, I'm going for the top tub. I'm just going to go for the top tub and finish it off. Because, yeah, I don't want that top tub to get a big hit on the Paratweet. Because, can the Paratweet take it out? I know it's a very evolution. He swapped out. When does Zulon get me? When the... Why are you going to Metatoad on a Vesperatu? I don't understand that play. Paratweet goes for Cyclone Slam. That's gonna do, like, almost nothing. So, yeah. Let's see who he brings out. I'm gonna see if I can get my... Yeah, I have to swap out. Dang it, I have to swap. I have to go in my Terra Claw. Because, yeah, that Metatoad can tank for days from Infernix. 
goes for the scavenge. He's gonna go for the cinema. Oh! Got a critical hit. Nice. Cinema also goes for pestilence on me. I'm a terror claw. I can take the hit pretty well. The thing that's scary is mainly Metatoad. I'm kinda worried about it. Okay, it's Watcher. The Metatoad is Watcher. But it's good to know. So, I'm going to try to find a way to get that. I'm going to try to find a way to get that Infernix in. Because Benetoad is actually one of the checks for Infernix. So, we definitely want to take out that Metatoad. My teammate brings up Kirlin. Kirlin looks very cool, by the way. I really like Kirlin's design. I definitely want to showcase Kirlin in the future. So we adapt the salt, goes for the Metatoad, Bug Bite on the Kirlin. Wait. <laughs> I missed I missed some text. So there we go. There we go. Metatoad is out of there. Now I can probably bring my I think I'm gonna bring my Infernix in. Oh I can't. The cinema is trapped in the end. Okay, so last one's Protagon. I can keep him alive, honestly. I'm just going to go after the Protagon. I can just keep the Cinema off there. And then just go after the Protagon and Mutagon and we can win this game. I think that's what we're going to do. Then once my Terror Claw goes down, I'm going to go for the... I'm going to go into my Inferno. So some Thunder Strike on me? It missed. Tasty in a nutshell. This is what got. Does nothing. I go for rough up. That did like a lot. Someone left the game. Someone left the game, didn't they? Did my teammate leave? No, his, their teammates left. Fortunately, didn't get the show in Furnace in that one. I didn't even get. I didn't even get the show in Furnace in that one. That is very unfortunate, and people are starting to leave. Fantastic. People are starting to leave. Well, this is unfortunate. I didn't even get the show in Furnix there. I got the show in Furnix in one fight, but I just don't think it's enough. Do I just... Might as well just try to accept more battles. Yep, I'll battle you. We're already 12 minutes in. This will be definitely the last battle. Let's see what Crash Cycle has. We have like a Himber or like a Tyrex or something. Ah, uh, this one's not going to work for me. He has a Seer Knight. I brought Wrestling though. Although he does have a Whipple Drift. And he does have a Joel Toop, which I can use it for. But Venolin, it's just not going to be easy to beat. I can use this for Skelet too because I'm nimble. But Sparadu, I'm going to bring that for a ton of these limits. Bring you... Oh, not really. Yeah, Wibble Drift's looking pretty scary. Do I bring Zulong? He has, he has a lot of gammas. He has like three gammas. Maybe even four. I want to bring Zulong. I want to bring it. But I think I'm going to let it hold. I think I'm going to hold on that. Alright, hopefully that Wibble Drift is not a big problem. He goes into Seer Knight. Oh, he goes into Seer Knight. I should be able to do half his health. He stays in. Okay. Oh, I de oh, I definitely do half his health. What if I slap down? That's not going to do that much. Let's go. That didn't do that much. I'm just going to click Fire Ref again. Well, that's huge for me. Having Seer Knight out of there is probably one of the best outcomes for me. So Infernix is already getting a nice kill early. Problem is, I think that's I think I'm low enough that Vesperati can pick me up. Whipple Drift comes in. I'm nimble 200. I'm nimble 200. I think this one shots you because I'm Pyro. Oh dear. I don't know what that move is all about. I took two Lumians out with Infernix. He's gonna bring that. Please bring someone I can, like, rest on. Darn, you brought Joel, too. Uh, I have to swap. 
Even though I, I have no swappings, though, I can't really swap to anything other than to clips. Which I will swap it to the clips, actually. So I want to save my Infernix for later. Maybe I can bring it back. That's definitely am Okay, not ambush. Not ambush. I'm going to go for the Gloom Roar. Is Doltoop dead? Okay, I already took out three Lumians in like the span of a minute. Is she going to bring Metal in? That's my shot. That's my, this is my only chance to get Infernix back in the battle. As much as I don't want to do this, this is my chance to get Infernix back in the battle. So I'm going to do this. Harder, I'm fine. I'm fine with this being very slow. I can rest. I can rest on this, and then I can Phoenix Flame. We'll see, though. Let's splatter. Do I live? I lived. I'm going to save it. I'm going to save you. I'm going to go into Himber. I'm going to go into my Himber. And let's see what we can do. Goes for another Bud Splatter. I just got to wait for someone to run out of energy. And then I can do something. He barters again? Why? Yes, he gave me Fire Wait. Hold on a second. Did he have no item? No, he has heavy shekels. Oh, I had my fire essence slapped down. That makes a lot more sense now. I'm just going to try to whack this Vesp as hard as I can. Vesperatu. This is a Gamma Vesperatu. And it's a range attacking one, too. Watch what that do. Ow. That's a solid amount of damage. I'm going to go for traps. And that's mainly because I kind of want my Infernix to do. I kind of want my Infernix to get the kill. I kinda, I'm going to try to get Infernix to do the kill, even though it's shackled. Even though it's shackled. I want to try to make Infernix get the kill. Oh, never mind. He's trying to sprint me, and he's out of there. Well, Infernix got two kills. That might have been the quickest battle I think I've ever had in a while. That was just... That Lumion's gone. That Lumion's gone. That Lumion is gone. That was just insane. So, there's Infernix. Highly offensive fire type with very good range bolt. I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all all later. Bye!